Hi, I just want to talk about uh, baldric carry for large knives and also uh, neck knives. Basically, baldric carry is just a uh, shoulder strap that you wear. This is a heavy duty strap I made out of uh, Latigo leather. Uh, this pad here is veg tanned with a doe skin lining on it. It adjusts with a brass buckle and has. Chicago screws that hold on these Maxpedition style clips, which then attach to this strap on the sheath. Uh, the sheath has a dual belt loop. The strap wraps around that. And I like to use the strap for attaching a smaller knife. You can just put this onto there. This one is a little Bark River um, Micro Canadian, I believe. So this pairs up your big blade with a smaller blade. This sheath is made for a Himalayan Imports Ancola that I rehandled with some leather and Osage Orange, and then I blew the blade on it. So that's a more heavy-duty rig. This one's a bit lighter duty. This is for a Valiant Golok Batong. Original sheath is wood. I tried to mimic some of the decorative elements on this one that I made up. It's one of my favorite woods blades. Um, this one has the same dual belt loop, but I just put through some paracord through these holes that I had punched and then doubled it up and put some overhand knots on there to make it adjustable. One of the benefits of the baldric carry is if you're wearing heavy clothing, um, you're able to have a heavy jacket on and get to your knife versus if you have it on a belt. I personally just don't like having uh, my knives on a belt. You can sit down and they jab into your side or your leg and they're kind of unwieldy. Um, I just like the option of carrying a knife on my side or around my neck. This little rig is made up for this little David Farmer knife, little Skinner. David uh, ground and heat treated this blade. I profiled it and put the redwood handles on it. And this also has attached to the baldric a little fire steel. And this one, it's kind of a more complex braid. Also has a belt loop and some eyelets that the paracord's running through. This uh, Groman I use a lot for fishing. So I just have this set up with simple loop of paracord. I got a piece of bone on there and this tri-glide so I can adjust it to whatever height I want it. And in the end, this clip is for my little fishing tools or my license, uh, my pocket knife, whatever else I want to have with me when I'm out fishing. Just another simple baldric. This is another uh, necker that I profiled and David Farmer did the grinding and heat treating on. This one's just set up to be worn as a necker. Um, this little loop here, you can attach other things onto this or just kind of, you know, adjust the uh, length as needed. that one. And then we have some smaller neck knives. This one is a uh, flint striker made by Daryl Ahn, who makes some great uh, fire pistons. It's a real nice curved loop in it. This one I just traced out an elm leaf and kind of 
made an elm leaf design on there. It's just a simple fold over, no welt. Paracord just runs through the end. Hangs on your neck like that. And a really cool, tiny little guy. This is uh, Scott Gossman, Fire Striker knife. It's uh, 01 steel. Just a tiny little blade, mostly made for striking a fire steel. Good little cutter. Doesn't weigh much and you hardly know it's there. So, just a quick look at some uh, neck knives and, and baldric carry.